Hi New Zealand, my name's Casey. I'm an intensive care paramedic with the Westpac Rescue Helicopter. I'm here to show you how to put CPR instructions into action, as shown on the Westpac Rescue Rashi. Let's talk about how to put instructions into action while the Westpac chopper is on its way. As you can see, these rashies are great for your little ones to wear near the water because they've got life-saving instructions ready to use right when you need them. So let's go through the steps. Each one has a letter to help us remember them. Make sure there is no danger. Safety for yourself and your patient is paramount. Check for a response. Squeeze the patient's shoulder and say, are you okay? Open your eyes. Send for help. Get someone to call 111. Open the airway. Tilt the chin back and open the mouth. If it's blocked, you need to roll the patient towards you and clear it. Look, listen and feel for breathing. This should take no more than 10 seconds. If they are breathing abnormally, start CPR. If they are breathing normally, roll them towards you. The next step is about how to perform CPR. The way we perform CPR is with either one or two hands in the centre of the chest. We compress the chest to at least a third of the depth of the chest. We use compressions at a 30 to 2 ratio, compressions to breath, and we compress the chest two times per second. After 30 compressions, it's time for the breaths. So tilt their head back, lift their chin, and pinch their nostrils. Put your mouth over their mouth and give two breaths. Keep going with 30 compressions, two breaths until help arrives. From Westpac and the Rescue Chopper crew, be sure to make the most of your holidays this Kiwi summer. Look after each other and yourselves.